So, had you always wanted to do a post-apocalyptic film before? Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. The beauty of post-apocalyptic films is, especially for low budget, is the fact that you've you've got this scenario where you've got minimal yes. people Although and situations to deal with. It does add its complications as well, though. But I think the good thing about it is that you can have a very strong story in and not be complicated with a lot of uh, unnecessary mm. fluff that you will get filming other things. But the post-apocalyptic thing allows you to be really quite creative and you get some fantastic action scenes in, you get some guns mm. and explosions yeah, a and yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, a bit of death, <laughs> a, bit uh, of death. a bit of rotting yeah. and all of that sort of thing. But there have yeah. been some, you know, we've got inspiration from films that we've watched, haven't we? Yeah, absolutely. Big fan of things like I Am Legend, you know, Book, of Eli, uh, yeah. Book of Eli, love Book the of road. Eli. The that, that, road, that's yeah. Lots of people actually. A lot of people, of people have said, said reminds me of the, of the road, and yeah. we certainly didn't go out with no, that in mind. Well, I haven't actually seen it. Have you? So no. Oh, you I've seen the something. book of Eli though. Now the important thing with this one is that uh, the whole premise is non-nuclear. It's mm. no zombies, no, no alien. I got, we got a comment on YouTube saying it's a change to have no zombies. Yeah. No. And yeah, which is good. Yeah. I don't think we could have so, dealt with zombies. No, I don't know. Not, not this time around. <laughs> we'll have to make a separate zombie movie. Mm. Yes.